Welcome to the Video Dictionary, where we explore the language and the words we use every day. If that's the sort of thing you're into, subscribe and click the little bell so you never miss a word. There was a comment on one of my previous videos where I was called pedantic. But let's take a look at this vocabulary word. Pedantic. Adjective. Loudly and proudly proclaiming minor points of learning and minutia. History and etymology. Pedantic is an adjective form of pedant, which comes from French, meaning schoolmaster. Several other languages have similar words for teacher or schoolmaster, like Italian, pedente. These words are apparently of unknown origin. They could be from the root prefix for pediatrics, pedo, meaning boy or child, or it could be from ped, meaning foot, as in like pedestrian, or common and dull. Vocabulary lesson. This segment is where I'm going to go over some memory techniques to help commit new words to memory in ways that make them useful and helps you understand them when you hear them. I know that many of you probably already know some of these words, but bear with me for people who might not. One technique for committing to memory new words is to make connections in your brain between the new words and words you already know. For example, as we've already seen, we can make an association between pedant and pediatric. Even if that's not an accurate etymology of the word, using the prefix ped, meaning children, can help you remember that a pedant is originally referred to someone that teaches children. And now in English, someone that's pedantic is generally talking down to you in an annoying way or pointing out small details that most people don't really need to know. I'm kind of into that stuff, so I've probably been pedantic quite a bit. But this is one of the major benefits of studying etymology and the origin of words. It helps you to, when you hear new words, it helps you to break down the words into the different components, whether they're Greek or Latin or French. And if you know those, what the roots mean, you can figure out what new words mean that you hear, and it can help you remember how to use new words that you've just learned. Another method to help the retention for definitions of words is to make associations in your mind with someone or something you're familiar with. In this case, I'm pretty much the perfect candidate. I'm pedantic. I like to point out small bits of detail about things. That's pretty much my entire channel, focusing on small bits of learning and detail and trumpeting it loudly. If you know anyone in your life that loves to interject small pieces of information almost to the point of nuisance or correcting people on small little details, Try connecting them in your brain. Create an image of them with this word. And throughout the next week, try and find situations where you can use this word and practice using it. That's one of the other ways, that's a great way to commit words to memory and actually work them into your vocabularies, actively using them. Thank you for watching. If you feel like you've learned something today, please leave a like and share this video with your friends. And until next time, keep on learning.